Hi everyone. It's been a while, I know. A lot of things have changed. I have moved. You can see I'm actually in a garage now, which I'll show you right here in a minute. Uh, I've also moved not just houses, but countries and continents. So that's actually changed a lot of things for me around here. Um, I got to rebuild out this garage, actually make it useful for me. I got a lot of bright projects to do. I've told you guys I was going to do what I was going to do and tell you about. I also have uh, new writing content. I'm going to have a series about me getting in shape for a major ride here. I uh, expect all these here to come soon. Um, but yeah, for now, let's do a bit of a uh, walk around of the garage or lack thereof right now. I just not outfitted at all in a way that makes sense. And uh, I need to figure that out and I'm gonna, you guys are gonna do that with me here along the way. So let's do that. So overall, the garage is not a big, it's a single car garage. It's got a one car garage door, which I, which I will not be using at all. It's only gonna be for um, a wall, really. I'm just gonna use this door I'm standing in right now to get around. Right now the bikes are also kind of piled up as with everything else in the garage. Everything's just kind of piled in here. I know some of the uh, other YouTubers uh, like Spindat would probably appreciate what's going on in here or lack thereof right now. Um, so things I need to do, I need to get my toolbox up off the floor. I need to get the bikes organized in a way that makes sense. So we got one, two, three, four, there's actually another bike back there, five, six bikes that we need to make sure we get in spaces that are going to be, uh, make them easy to access one and out of the way, number two, so we can have as much space as we can have in here for bigger projects on the particular bikes. Yeah, so that's gonna be an definitely an interesting project to do. Um, my idea is right now, is right over here in this area where these bikes are, is actually have them filed in. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm gonna make a uh, rear wheel stand that's gonna hold them up um, that allow me to roll them out from here to the door quickly. Uh, reasons for that is I commute on my bike every day. I don't always like to commute on the same bike while it's normally uh, this guy right here. See this bike here, which is a custom titanium bike, which I'll do a video about in the future, uh, hopefully in the next month or so. Um, yeah. I normally ride that to work, but I, sometimes I like to take either the fat bike or the mountain bike, depending on conditions or what I want to do throughout the day. Near my work, luckily now, I actually have some dirt trails. I can go do some dirt jumps and some other things along those lines, which is really kind of cool. It opens up some possibilities. Also where I am, there's a fair amount of snow. Um, so fat bike will be actually be seeing snow duty, not just trail duty, which I kind of built it up for, which is cool, fun, and be interesting. So. The next big area I need to work on is over here, the toolbox. Obviously a toolbox on the ground is a terrible place. It makes you lean over, it's not accessible. Uh, it's just not conducive to work. So I have two plans. Plan number one, move the toolbox to over here. But that's not gonna work either because I have bikes which will, which will eventually be over there. But I'm gonna build shelves to get it up off the ground to you know normal standard work level height. Um, so what I plan on doing is actually building a shelf that's fairly long, putting it up on top of it, having some storage underneath for other items that you have seen around the garage. But more importantly, it's also gonna be a little bit of workspace on and off to the other side. Here, I'm having a workbench come in. That's gonna be the workbench that you've seen before in some of my older videos when I was actually still in the States. Um, that's arriving here, hopefully in the next month or so. That's gonna be the main project area. The tools are gonna to be right over here next to it. So that's gonna allow us to do some more fun work. But in general though, it should be noted that the riding here should be a lot more interesting. Less road riding, more mountain biking, more adventuring around. Uh, the roads here are just more conducive to that style of riding. Uh, China was great where I was before for doing big, massive, long road rides, but I don't really find those that interesting in the video. Uh, I do have some that I have, that I have filmed that I haven't actually produced, which I hopefully will do in the next couple months as well, start catching up on things. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, subscribe and like it. Uh, I have a lot more content coming out. If you have any suggestions for videos, there's quite a few I have in the queue from people's suggestions. Um, leave it in the comment below and just ride. <laughs>